Hello everyone, this is Tina with Tiaz's Treasures and today I have for you day 18 of the Crafty Advent Calendar. 18, so let's take a look. This is day 18 right there. Let's see what we have. We have this paper. Oh my gosh, we have more sequins. These are a beautiful purple iridescent sequin. Wow, and I just made a shaker card yesterday, or a shaker tag, I should say. But what are we going to do with the sequins? Well, maybe another shaker? I don't know. I'm going to have to think about it, and um, we will make something. So I wasn't sure what I was going to do with these sequins, being as yesterday we used the pink ones from day nine, and here we are nine days later uh, with the purple. So I thought, well, let's just go all out purple. So I brought in an embossing folder from Simon Says called Fanciful, Fanciful Flurries. Say that three times quick. And I've got a Spellbinders die set called the Laird Poinsettia. Poinsettia. Um, so I went ahead and embossed a piece of purple metallic paper. It's paper. It's not actually cardstock, so it's a little bit on the thinner side. And I cut out the poinsettia. Uh, we've got four different layers here. I guess you could keep layering it more if you wanted. But I did three different shades of purple, and then I used a kind of a, almost a um, purplish blue, very light purple, more blue, um, for the leaves, color card stock. And then we're gonna use our purple sequence in the middle of our poinsettia, and then we're gonna put some probably around for bling on our paper here. And then I've got the word joy that I foiled. Um, I think it was the Simon Hurley. No, I think this was a different. Yeah, I'm not sure what that was. I think it's a uh, Simon Says Stamp um, foil plate. I do have Simon Hurley and Spellbinders foil plates as well with Christmas sentiments. But I thought the simple just word joy so let's go ahead and glue down the embossed paper. And we're going to go from there. That glue down. Now this piece of metallic paper is cut to four by five and a quarter. And it's not even. Okay. Mm -hmm. I'm going to go ahead and get our poinsettia glued down. And it just like doing the middle a bit makes it easier to tuck things in. We're not going to see that. That's going to dry clear. And kind of put this in between. And we have this little piece here. Last, our last little piece. There, and then when they dry, we can kind of get the leaves to go up a little bit, give it some texture. Put 
that under there. Oh, look, my piece moved. <laughs> Needs to dry a bit, but it's on the metallic cardstock, so it's going to take a little bit extra time to dry. Get some of these out. Okie dokie. Get this in there. A few of them. Don't need a whole lot. Now. Let's see. Get three little blue dots here in the middle. And I know my husband's making some noise out there. Try to get some of the smaller sequins because it looks like it's a few different sizes here. Flip that one over. There we go. That's pretty. Let's put a few of these in some other spots here. Put that there. Oops, if I can get it to flip over again. And uh, oh, this one flipped there. We might as well just keep it there. I believe that one tried to escape when we were pouring them in my little tray here. And uh, and flipped over as well because these are a little bit cup shaped. I have to have them on the right side. Put this one in the center of a snowflake. There we go. Uh, right down there. Um, well, we need one over here, I would say, too. Might not be the center of a snowflake, but we need it there. And maybe right there. No, that one's... Uh, no, I think right there. And anywhere else? I think maybe that's it. So, and then we need our joy. Forget about our joy. Which good thing it's going right there because there's no sequins there. Huh? I think if there were sequins there, there would still be time to move it. Move the sequins, that is. We will. Uh, husband's calling my dog. He knew I was recording. I think he forgets. <laughs> like I'm going in my, my craft room. I'm gonna do some recording. Be quiet, and then five minutes later, I hear him making noise. So, this is our purple Christmas poinsettia card with the sequins that came on day 18. And I just think that's lovely. So, anyway, that's it for now, everyone. Bye-bye.